going to four different coffee shops and trying their seasonal hot chocolates. We are going to Dutch Bros, Starbucks, Black Rock, and the Human Bean. And we're going to get whatever seasonal hot chocolate they have and we're going to rate them. If you're new here, I'm Rachel. I'm Connor. We have a week old baby named Logan. And we have two dogs, Bear and Kona, who are with us today. Logan's at home with her grandmas. <laughs> and this is the first time I've been out of the house in a week. Kona is ready to go. Let's do it. The first stop is Starbucks. I think you're choosing our Starbucks. We're going to get you. Do you guys have like a seasonal hot chocolate? Um, we have a peppermint mocha and a peppermint white mocha. Okay, perfect. Okay. I'll do that. All right. We also what size? Um, this is small. And did you still want the whip and the topping? Yes, please. 1824 today. Thank you so much. The hot chocolate. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah, have a good day. You too. So we got the first drink we got at Starbucks. It is a peppermint. Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. They call it a mocha. But there's she's no she coffee. informed there's no coffee in it, we asked. Or we're gonna be rating each one on three things. We're gonna do taste, the cup design, and the price. So the price of the coffee was or the hot chocolate. Four dollars and twenty-five cents. For a small, small, like the tall, short one. Let's, on a scale of one to 10, what do you rate it for the cup design? Let's see this, let's check it out. Is there a cute holiday? Starbucks does do a really good job with their cups. Let me get it off. What does it have like? Okay, that's pretty cute. Christmas trees, different colors. I'd give that a eight, eight out of 10. Okay, I'm gonna give it a nine. Okay, and last but not least, taste. It's probably gonna be hot. Very peppermint. Very peppermint. If you like peppermint, you'd like this. It's very, very, very much peppermint. So on taste, on a scale of one to ten, what do you give it? I'd say seven out of ten. That's what I was gonna say. I'm gonna say seven out of ten. Okay. So overall, what do you rate Starbucks peppermint mocha? Well, it's a little pricey. I agree. For what you like the size. Cup is all right. Taste is all right. I would say overall. Six and a half out of ten. Okay, I'll go with seven. Just thinking. Okay. okay, let's go to the next place, which is gonna be the, the next one. Human being. Hey there. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. What can I get for you guys? Do you have like a holiday themed hot chocolate? Um, we have a toasted hot chocolate. Okay. One that has toasted marshmallow with a little marshmallow on top. I'll do that. Yeah. Yeah. Size? That's small. That's small. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Do you want one for you? Yes, please. Do you want the bean on top? Yes, please. Okay. Sure, yeah. Yes. Come on, get in the back. Awesome. Awesome, thank you so not. much. You too. Kona! <laughs> She'd show it from both of them. Here, Human bean toasty cocoa is what it was. Yeah, toasty cocoa is their holiday. I, had n I have no idea what the price was. Three seventy one. Cool cup. I like the cup. I, I think like it's really cup. cute. I like all the colors. I'm giving that a nine out of ten. I'll give that a nine out of ten as well. Wow! Look, look at, at the that. marshmallow coming out the top. I don't know if they can see that. <laughs> Marshmallows oozing out. I'm nice little the touch. Bean. The bean. Good touch. Mm, I love the cup. Chocolate cup. Okay, so eight out of ten on the cup. Price better better than Starbucks for the small. Mm. Oh, going in for a second sip right away. Okay, what do you give it? Well, it has like marshmallows in it. It's really good. I'm gonna give this one, and I would say. I was gonna say nine. So overall, I give them a nine. Yeah. It's really hot though. Really hot. Nine out of ten. Really cute cup. The human being. Like it. All right. It's good. Okay. On to the next. One more thing about the human being. Uh, they deserve that nine out of ten. They gave our dogs two dog treats. Yep. They yep. even offer it. We didn't ask. Yep. Didn't ask. Didn't ask Starbucks either. So. But. Service. The next stop is Black Rock Coffee. Honestly, 
Don't think I've ever been here. Have you been to a black rock before? No. If you have, let us know in the comments below if you have a black rock wherever you live. In Oregon, growing up, we definitely had them, but they were never convenient. You have, we have them here in Idaho. I just don't know, are they like a nationwide thing? Are they a Pacific Northwest thing? Let us know down in the comments. Yeah, let us know. Do you have black rock where you live? Hi, welcome black rock, what are we here Hi, do you guys have like a holiday themed hot chocolate? I can do like a peppermint hot chocolate. Okay, yeah, let's do that. All right, anything else today? That'll be it. Small. And what size? Uh, small. All right, we'll see you up here in the window. All right, thank you. So their holiday theme is also going to be a peppermint mocha, just like, or peppermint hot chocolate like Starbucks was. So on the drive from the human being to Black Rock, it's like a four minute drive. But Connor and I were just talking about how Today, Logan is a week old, and I have we haven't spent any time away from her at all, except for today. We haven't left the house. We haven't left the house, um, except for this little adventure to go try out some coffee in the car. I was kind of getting stir crazy, but didn't want to do anything too active, so it just feels weird. A week ago, we didn't have a kid. Now we have a kid, and we feel like we're, we're missing something. Yeah. Funny how that works. We've been gone for 30 minutes, not even yet. And we're like, oh, we miss her. We miss her so much. <laughs> okay. Black rock coffee. Peppermint hot chocolate. Cute. Completely different. It's completely not like completely different. Yeah. Holiday themed necessarily. It's like winter themed. Yeah, I love it. The color's interesting. It's like eight out of ten for me. Really? I'm gonna go with like six. Okay. I like it, but I just think like I, I really like the holiday spirit ones. <laughs> I like it because it's different. It's more like hot chocolate. Because <laughs> it's gonna be hot. I know it's gonna be a really hot one. We might not be able to drink it right away. I'll let you bring your tongue first. It's actually, it's not hot at all. Is the cup heated or something? Completely different than Starbucks peppermint hot chocolate. Completely different. Completely different. Like. Completely different. <laughs> so different. Like it's not. There's not as much peppermint for sure. No. It also doesn't taste as sugary to me. No. What do you rate it? Six and a half. Interesting. What did you rate Starbucks? I don't remember. Okay. I would give this one a higher score of a Starbucks. I think I would definitely give this one like a seven or an eight. I like the taste of this peppermint hot chocolate better than the other one. For me, it's not as strong or potent of a peppermint flavor. Yeah. And yeah. I like peppermint, so don't get me wrong, but yeah. the other one was like, Starbucks you in the is face. very, very pepperminty. This one's not as much. I don't like the flavor. You don't like the flavor of the hot chocolate? Not as much. It doesn't taste maybe it's made with um, more water than milk or something. I don't know. Yeah. So overall. Uh, price. $3.66. Yeah. Um, so cheapest one yet. Cheapest one yet. So overall, I'm I would gonna say, say seven. Yeah, I'll give it a solid seven. Cup design, good. Taste, eh. Price, good. Last but not least. Alright, last one. Okay, the last one is Dutch Bros. Connor and I don't go buy coffee. Like, I'm not a huge coffee drinker. Connor always makes his morning coffee at home. If we're gonna have hot chocolate, we would make it at home. So we decided it'd be fun to come out and just try what people are, what the different companies are selling this year. See what it's, see what's good. Hello. How's it going? Good, how are you doing today? Good. Hey, do you have a holiday themed hot chocolate? Oh, uh, we can do candy cane. Okay, yeah, I'll try that. You wanna do that? Yes. What size would you like? This is small. This is small. That'll be it. That'll just be 387 for you today, man. Okay. Alright, man. You're all set. Cool. Thank you. Of course. Have a good day. You too. I think right now my only stress is like I'm breastfeeding, so I only have two to three hours between each feeding. So we have gone through three drive throughs already. And this is by far the longest drive through. There's only one car in front of us, but we haven't had to wait. Oh, I guess we had to wait at Black Rock too. 
that went really quick. But now at Dutch Bros, there is we had four cars coming behind us. Yeah, four cars behind us. So as far as busy, they're Dutch definitely Bros. the most busy out yeah. of all of them. Yeah. I guess that's another question. Like Human Bean, I'm pretty sure is a like Pacific Northwest company. So watch out. Do you have the candy cane? Yes. Perfect, there's that for you. Awesome, thank yeah, you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Oh gosh, we're running out. So this is a candy cane hot chocolate. So assuming it's gonna, yeah. gonna be like a peppermint hot chocolate kind of. All right, so here's the Dutch Bros. Candy cane hot chocolate. What do you rate the say, cut? As far, as far as holiday themed, I think that one takes the cake. This one takes the cake. This yeah. one gets a 10 for like the cut. Yeah, 10 Absolutely. Out of 10. The price was like 371. Okay. So pretty much it. They've all Great. been there except for Starbucks right yep. in that 370-ish range. Under, yeah, under $4. Under $4. Yeah. Yep. Nervous it's gonna be hot. Lots of whipped cream. I'm not gonna comment until Connor tastes it. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> that one's like... Yeah, 10 out of 10. That's a 10 out of 10. Yeah. That one's so good. Okay. This one's definitely... Nailed it. Nice. Dutch Bros, you nailed it. We don't yep. go to you and we obviously sometimes laugh because I feel like the line is so long when we drive by and we're like, who would wait in that uh, line? Such weird times of the day too. Like, but they've got, but, hey, they've got good drinks. This is a good drink. This yep. is really good. This is by far the best one. Okay, so... Favorite to least favorite. So for me, I would go Dutch Bros, the human bean, and then I think I would then go Black Rock Starbucks, actually. Would you? Yeah. So I'd go Dutch Bros, human bean, Starbucks, and then Black Rock. Well, that is a wrap on our holiday themed hot chocolate trial from four major coffee shops around us. We hope you enjoyed the video. We sure did. Our taste buds did. That's for sure. We have a lot of hot chocolate to finish now. That's right. But one other thing, we are trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. So please, please, please go hit that subscribe button and follow along on our journey. Like this video and we'll see you in a couple days. Oh, and I guess what? Logan will be in the next video. Oh yeah. Most likely. Yep. Yeah.